Hey everyone, it's Ted here from Ted's Gaming Room, and today we're talking about uh, in another uh, uniform book. Today we're talking about the, uh, Napoleon's Last Army of Waterloo, uh, research and text by Paul Dawson, and the artwork by Keith Ro Rocco, uh, put out by the President International Napoleonic Society. This book is a very gorgeous book uh, on um, Napoleonic warfare. Um, he, they go through and it do uh, different um, uh, units from Napoleon's army. Uh, they give a, a grenadiers a, a, a paid of the Imperial Guard. Uh, gives a beautiful painting. One of his paintings he's done through the years. And on the left hand side it gives gives a uh, a, a short back, um, background on the regiment. And this book is chock full of all his paintings he's done through, over the years. Artillerymen of the Guard, and I said on that side, a, a quick synopsis of the regiment and some history of the stuff. So, this is another another one of those books that um, um, painters can add to the collection to give them just more references and stuff, uh, more background uh, on regiments uh, for painting, uh, for anyone else, this is a beautiful book to have in a collection if you're uh, want books on Napoleon um, or Napoleonic warfare from that period and stuff. So, so uh, you got, got Mameluke of the Guard, beautiful painting, and, it's a, and a quick a little synopsis and some artifacts from the period of, of the. But it's this this covers just Napoleon's army. Uh, this book came out. Uh, er, uh, Earlier this year, it was a Kickstarter that was put out, uh, but now it's available to purchase and stuff. So if, if you're looking for uh, a book, you want to learn, learn some more about Napoleon's um, armies, um, regiments, and stuff like that, just to expand your knowledge. And or if you want some more painting guides um, to add to your collection, say never need to, there's no such thing as too many painting guides. <laughs> more, more is actually better because you'd be surprised how many books and authors will you read through and it'd be something different in the written down differently and stuff uh, and especially colors because a lot of books just gives you a uh, description of a color they you know of uh, the cuffs or stuff like that but actually seeing it uh, and in color you can actually know what color it is because sometimes they say what the color and you're, what you're trying to imagine what it is. It's usually, it might not be what you think it is. So this way, it just gives you more looks. And so you get to see it. This is, a lot of this stuff is from uh, uh, museum, museums and stuff in Europe and stuff. So you can actually actually see the original uniform and stuff. And what it actually looked like. So, yep. Yeah, uh, I said, this is another fine book to add to your shelf. And to knowledge and stuff like that. Um, so I would recommend I would recommend this a lot. If you you can get a copy, find a copy. This has been a, this nice nice book to add to your collection and for reading or anything else. So um, thank you uh, for watching. Please hit subscribe and like. Um, and I'll see you guys later.